Oh, hi everyone, this is Makan. Welcome all of you to my channel. So, after a long, once again I am in YouTube. So, so this video is all about uh, the technical officer that is conducted by BRC. So, as you know, BRC has published the notification and I had appeared for the interview for uh, this year. The results still under consideration and uh, it's not published. So, let's see what is the result. But, uh, this video is all about the upcoming uh, written examination for technical officer uh, C, uh, conducted by BRC. So as the exam dates has been published and this time I had not applied for the written exam. Okay. So I just uh, want to deliver the things uh, that for the written examination, what kind of possible questions and the pattern of the examination. So as you know, last time the examination was consist of 50 questions and the mark for each question was two marks so uh, three marks. So it's all about 150 marks within two hours you have to solve and if you ask me the question level then question level was little tricky right so calculative questions are there you have to do it uh, by pen and paper it was purely offline based examination but this time since the applicant number is more than 10,000 as I get the information from the uh, students so I think uh, this time definitely the question will be uh, the examination will be in online mode. It will be a CBT pattern and the examination will be conducted in the respective states. So I can suggest to one thing this question is going to be or this paper is going to be for two hours and the question level will be moderate. Okay. So you can expect the questions like gate and a little bit like uh, OCS DGFS pattern uh, and if the question paper will be a based on moderate to difficult level question it will be two hour examination if it will be on consist of 100 questions and easy questions then purely it will be like OCS type questions okay so for my experience from my experience of last year technical officer written examination I will suggest you cover all the portions that from uh, nine papers is there uh, all about that mathematical quantum statistical whatever is there so read the formulas okay and little bit to other concept and try to solve as much as possible that my strategy always and uh, focus on the accuracy last time uh, I, I can convey one information through this video is like ki last time out of 50 questions I had solved 37 questions and after the examination I come to know I came to know that two questions are lit directly wrong I have attempted the wrong attempts so uh, that thing uh, that that means I had appeared for 35 correct questions correct, correct answer right so also people have appeared 25 out of 50 one of my friend has appeared 25 questions and still he could able to uh, crack that written examination and I had uh, she had appeared for the interview right. So similarly in this year I will like to suggest to one thing that focus on the accuracy and don't for uh, go for the higher uh, attempt like 45 46 don't need uh, don't no need of to attempt 45 46 questions okay. And uh, prepare uh, as you are preparing for OCS, DGFS and GATE, it is similar to that. No need to do anything extra for the examination. But the point is like accuracy. You should be conscious on the accuracy point. And uh, try to solve, uh, uh, if it is a 50 mark, 50 question, then try to solve above 30. And if it is a 100 mark question, then try to solve above 60, 70, depending upon the question level. And for the interview perspective, I had appeared the interview. Uh, I will bring all the interview experience of myself and my, all of my friends and little bit uh, collection question I have already collected. So don't worry about the interview session. I will uh, put all the videos with a very high quality so that you can get all the types of questions they are asking. But one thing I would like to suggest to you that the interview say level is uh, similar to OCS DGFS but time is less. That means in OCS, OCS or DGFS you are a, you are interviewed for more than one hour like like one hour 15 minute or one hour 20 minute but in case of uh, technical officer they are taking interview for 45 minute 50 minute or 40 minute so this is the difference that means you will be interviewed for three to four subject instead of five to six subject that is the difference but the question level is like that because the same people are taking your interview they will try to make you some confusion they will try to make you put in some <laughs> kind of <laughs> difficult situation and try to uh, check your calibrity how you are defending the situation that is the same way they are taking the interview same same was happening to me also in this time and interview was going very good for me and uh, as well as from my friend also they have appeared very nice 
questions and uh, did a very well in the interview let's see what is the reason that is the different part of the story but from our side our should our effort should be perfect so that uh, we will we will think like we have given all the effort that that can be possible from our side nothing we can do more than that so just go with the flow make your pace and prepare well for the examination conceptually try to overcome all the horrors so that you can appear more number of questions with great accuracy that's it and don't do anything extra don't be extra serious for the technical officer go with the flow because the gate examination is there in february before that you are your csr examination and for the odisha people ssb examination is there in the december so whatever preparation you are doing go with that flow okay and uh, believe in my word that question will be same level you have to perform with accuracy then definitely will crack the examination and the interview pattern will be similar as i have prepare uh, as i have put a lot of video on from my experience as from my friends experience go through that video and prepare in that way so that you can able to defense them in the interview session and that's all of my side and one thing is like i will put all the questions that are asked previously in the technical officer in a, a ppt format and a video will be there and i will try to publish it within 2 to 3 days because i am getting little busy so hopefully i will continue this session for technical officer so that you will be benefited and no information is conveyed due to lack of the because technical officer is conducted for the first time okay so there is no experience from people ki which uh, pattern and uh, type of questions they are asking in the interview but it's a good job it is equal to the scientific officer you will be assigned as a scientist in brc job level is same scale pay is same and promotion is fantastic so don't delay try for your best and put all the effort that is possible don't waste your time okay so just focus on the study and i am trying to help you as much as possible through my youtube channel so stay connected with my channel hopefully within one to two week you will get all the video regarding the written and uh, interview session for technical officer stay tuned with my channel thank you so much <laughs> Thank you for uh, watching my video. I am always with you. Just prepare well for the examination. Thank you so much for observing for watching my video. Thank you.